Hi, this is Ken Kappel from Capital Cycles. Willie, go ahead, fire it up. Just want to show you this kit, this Ducati too. He's got a tight motor. Um, it fires right up. The uh, the carburetor is not. The carburetor is uh, going to be need to be cleaned. But just it, it's got excellent compression. Fires right up. It also um, is going to need a seat. The seat blew off on the back of the truck during transport. So um, this bike has a brand new. Uh, what brand is that exhaust? Do you know, off the top of your head? Off brand. I think it's a Denco. Um, it's a. It looks like it's a, like a factory type exhaust system. It's got the uh, the cone type uh, setup on here. Um, it doesn't have the baffle on there, so it's going to need a baffle and a seat. Other than that, it appears to be all complete. A couple of bolts missing on the on the bike, but everything's there. The engine's in excellent condition. Uh, carb, uh, gas tank. Uh, the gas tank alone. We thought about parting this thing out. Uh, if you look on eBay. Actually, we just sold the tank, didn't we? A Takati 350. Yeah. How much did we get for it? $350. $350. We just sold one on Old Bike Parts for You for $350. Uh, that's our other website, Kaplan Cycles Old Bike Parts for You. This back tail piece here is probably worth $300. I mean, there's thousands in parts if you part it out, but I'm a bike enthusiast, and to rip apart a perfectly good trike like this just to make money seems stupid, so I'd like to see this go to a good home. Oh, this has the original headlight. Um, it doesn't look like it's ever been rolled over, which is one of the curses these had is they're easily rolled. The front uh, fender, everything on the front here is nice and straight. The original clutch pulls like butter. Uh, on off for the lights. Uh, the switches are all good. The, the um, gas tank's in beautiful condition. We didn't even clean it. That's just the way it came to us. Um, the back tail piece is in really good shape. has original graphics on it. Obviously, a bike that was not beat on and hardly ever ridden. I'll bet this thing has very, very low hours. Look at the pegs on it. Pegs are perfectly straight. Shifter's perfectly straight. Peg on this side. The uh, brake is, is perfectly straight. The Kickstarter's like, like a brand new Kickstarter. Like it just came out of the box. It's not all played. It has the perfect detent on it and the perfect spring action. Um, I mean, that's, that's an obvious clue. This thing has been, not been started many times. Swing arm's in excellent shape. The paint needs to be redone on the swing arm. Uh, you know, the bike is, uh, let's see, 33 years old, so they didn't put a lot of paint on it from the factory. So the rear disc brake is good. Uh, the rims appear to be in excellent condition. Front forks are in excellent condition. Um, absolutely, this is a trike that you could go through. This is an ATC you can go through. A um, couple weekends of TLC and have this thing looking badass. Put a seat on it. Maybe get some NOS graphics. Um, clear, I think you can clear coat defenders and the green will come back. You, certainly you could sand them down and clear coat them. The original uh, radiator is in excellent condition as is the headlight. Uh, again, that exhaust, um, that exhaust system, we had the exact same one listed on Old Bike Parts View for, how much was it listed for? Uh, $400. $400. I, and again, I believe it's a Denco, but I'm not positive. It, this came from Chaplin Kawasaki. Kenny Ive shop, Ch Kenny was really into the trikes. He had some real big dollar, uh, high-end trikes. Um, so, in any event, this one here is all there. Just missing a couple parts, but uh, it's in, in excellent condition. And uh, I believe it's e these are even the original factory handlebars on it, which are still straight, which if you ride off-road, you know, you, you, you drop your bike or flip it, things get bent and broken quickly. And this thing's largely straight, especially for the year. So hope it goes to a good home. If you have any questions about it, give us a call at 860-454-7024. Again, it fired right up. So I'm quite sure if you put fresh gas in the tank, cleaned out the petcock, cleaned out the carb, you have yourself an awesome runner. So I hope it goes to a great home and it gets another lease on life and another 33 years of, of, of uh, enjoyment. So it's a beauty. Good luck bidding on it. God bless America.